you said that your music was was quite different from from what I guess the Indian crowd is used to. I think so. Well, I think they they go crazy about Bollywood stuff down there. Yeah, they loving it. And so, like, um, they don't have a big live scene of mm. touring international bands the way that most of most other countries yeah. do. Um, it's just not, or well, historically, it hasn't really been a focus. So the focus on live music, the way we know it, with more like commercial westernized kind of bands going to play there, um, I think is something of recent years. And so it's all quite new and developing, and they flew us out. It was someone who had seen me play in L.A. Okay. who ended up, um, booking us to come and do this little week, week and a half long tour of Delhi and Mumbai in India last year. Your first year. time in India? Yeah. What did you think of it? It was epic. Yeah, I mean, I've been dreaming about going to India for years. Um, it's always been on my hit list and I'm very um, enthusiastic about the culture and mm -hmm. just the place. So, I, it, But then when we went there for that week and a half, they treated us like absolute rock stars. I think they, they obviously didn't realize how much of a non-event we really are, like in the grand <laughs> scheme of things. They thought I was like some big rock star band because they'd seen me in LA. And um, even though I'm all about trying to pretend I am those things. Uh, you totally are. You should just play that up. Well, I did. We, we, we got there. We we're like, <laughs> oh, yeah, of course we've got like two cars and like this awesome hotel and drivers the whole way. And it was just very, we were very well taken care of, which was nice. But it was totally the opposite of the kind of first Indian experience I'd planned on having, yeah. which was more like me in a backpack and one pair of shorts and a scarf for six months or something. <laughs> but um, that didn't happen at all. We were just like treated like royalty for a week and a half and the gigs were epic and the crowds were so friendly and so nice. And um, yeah, I hope to be back there.